everyone, welcome back to my makeup channel. I am going to do a New Year's Eve makeup look. Um, it's a smoky eye with a little bit of blue and it's dramatic with two lip options and I hope you enjoy. I'm going to start off with Nutmeg Highlight Powder from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I'm just going to use that to set my concealer on my brows. I already have my foundation and concealer on and I'm just going to set my under eye, not under eye, underneath the brow. Then I'm going to go in with Brown Script Eyeshadow by MAC. It's a lovely orange brown that helps transition any kind of eyeshadow look you want to do. So it's going to really help transition our dark colors that's going to come on later. So just blend it into your crease. Then after that, I'm going to lay down a black base, which is Immortals Gel Liner and Immortal. <laughs> Immortal Gel Liner by Makeup Geek. And you just want to concentrate that in your outer V and blend it into the inner corner of your eye. And then go back with brown script to blend everything together. You just want to blend each step of the way to help you with the whole blending process. And then on top of that black base, we're going to apply Mermaid Eyeshadow from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And that black base really helps that blue to pop more. And you just want to blend as you're applying the blue eyeshadow. Then going back in with brown script, you just really want to have your orange brown to pop through this look. Now for the shimmer and glitter, this lovely pigment by Makeup Geek, I honestly just like the best pigment they ever came with. and. It's really cool because when you pair it with another eyeshadow, it kind of changes color, which is really cool. You just want to apply that to the first half of your eye. Make sure to spray it with a makeup spray to foil it, and then apply it. And apply it into your tear duct as well to give you a nice glow. And now I am going back in with Mermaid Eyeshadow. I foiled it and reapplied and blend and also going back in with brown script to blend out all the eyeshadow. Now for the bottom lash line, your waterline, you're going to apply Immortal Gel Liner by Makeup Geek and just apply it to your waterline and smudge it down to your uh, lash line and you're gonna go in with mermaid eyeshadow and just really smoke it out to give you a nice smoky blue on the bottom lash line. It just really gives you the I am the shit look and I really love how that looks. I happen to do that recently a lot and I just love the look. Now I'm gonna go in with Topaz Powder by Ben Nye. Topaz Ben Nye, yes. And just highlight the points of your face wherever you want to highlight. So I'm highlighting underneath my eye, my nose, my forehead, my chin, and yeah, highlight away. And now I'm going to go in with Corab and Espresso Contour Powder from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And you just want to carve out your cheekbone and blend it into your temples, your jawline as well. And now I'm using an eBay brush to go in with MAC Fever Blush. And I love this blush because it's not too bright and it really goes well with smoky eyes. And I forgot to contour my nose, so go back in and contour your nose. And yeah. Now I'm going to highlight with Topaz from Becca and I absolutely love this highlighter because it's so finely milled and it just makes your skin glow and I had issues finding like a really nice highlighter for dark skin and I found it. I totally found it. Um, and I'm going to go in and line my eyes really easily and you can use a gel liner with this pigment. You usually want to go in with liquid liner for pigments, not pigments, with the glitter. But since this is like a pigment, it's not going to have an issue with using gel liner. And I'm definitely going in with Iconic Lashes by House of Lashes. I 
now truly understand why everybody loves iconic lashes because they are just fabulous and they're not heavy on your eyes and they're easy to wear and I'm in love. I love them. Uh, yeah, I was just having a jam session. I should really make an outtakes video for this makeup tutorial because I was like, it was a lot going on. And for the first look, we're applying Chestnut Lip Liner by MAC Thickly because the lipstick's a bit pale. And But I absolutely love this lip combo because when you apply that lip glass on top, it's just <sighs> everything you want in life. I love this lip combination. This is like my go-to nude. I love it. Love. Love it. <laughs> now for in my being so true to myself, this is in totally being Rachel right now. I love wearing bright purple lips with dramatic eyes. It looks amazing. I love it. And this is Wild Orchid by Gerard Cosmetics. That lip gloss is just everything. Everything. And that's pretty much it for the makeup look. Now on to the outfit of the night. Um, yeah. I'm gonna be wearing these pants in the top. The top is from Charlotte Ruth. The pants are from H&M and the shoes are from Just Fab. Everything will be listed in the description box down below. And when I wear patterns like this, I happen to wear very minimum um, jewelry. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. And yeah all my social medias on the side over there be sure to um subscribe to them or follow my instagram and all that stuff all that good stuff and i hope you guys have a great new year's eve and be safe drink responsibly and have a blast and i love you guys i'll see you in 2015 bye